She's attended Comic-Con for 15 years and still smells great. She wrote a comic book and predicted the end of the world. She has competed in the masquerade while pregnant, wearing nothing but a bikini. She has come to San Diego every year for the last 10 and has never been to the beach. She's met Darth Maul and lived to tell about it. To my BFF. She's 40 and gets catcalls while in costume from priests. Oh. Her legend precedes her like Keaton precedes Bale. She is the most interesting woman in the world. I don't go to every convention, but when I do, I prefer Comic-Con. Hey, what's your name? Hi, I'm Jen King. What you got there that's worth watching for? I am probably the perfect person for your documentary because I pretty much live and breathe Comic-Con year-round. Are you living in a dream world? Um, yeah, it's a... I, I think it's a healthy obsession, but uh, I can't uh, promise that. How long have you been competing in the masquerade? I have attended Comic-Con for roughly 15 years. Uh, most bright at the beginning, but solidly since 2000. I haven't missed a single year. I've competed in the masquerade since 2001. So, what are you going to be doing at the convention? I have a huge following of people that have volunteered to be in my acts and ask every year if they can be in them again. And although this year Mac doesn't require very many people, I still have people ask me if they can just come backstage and help. I'd love to wear my costumes around um, a couple of the days on the floor. I love to have my picture taken and uh, to be recognized as who I'm dressing. Uh, this year I am going to be wearing Iron Man cheerleader costume in the new movie. And I'm hoping to have uh, some more of them to bring with me and see if I can find some other sexy ladies to wear them and go around as a kind of a group of people together. And also my friends from last year who all did the Princess Bride with me, some of them wanted to get together and do that again, uh, just as a walk around. So I will probably be going as an Eagle Matoya this year. Do you feel like you have formed a bond of marriage with your costume? I am completely enraptured with the process of that competition and I love how many friends that I've made. I actually made some of my very best friends because I didn't know what I was doing at the beginning and people just of their own accord would come back stage and I can get pointers and help me out. Very giving, loving people um, in that crowd. So with all your experience in the masquerade, do you feel like you can now share your talents with other people? I am probably the most interesting person to follow around because I do have so much experience back there. I get to return those favors now. Whoa, what makes you think you're going to be so fun? <laughs> <laughs> Please choose Jen. There's not a lot of money in the bank.